Nine years ago, these embers lit up the sky and gutted the historic Pilgrim Baptist Church. But now there's a new fire brewing at the Bronzeville Place of Worship, this one within the membership. The slow going process to rebuild has some asking for refunds. Our Dorothy Tucker has an original report and hundreds of thousands of dollars in question. I love that church. So much so that when Pilgrim Baptist, Howard Metley's church home for 70 years, Burned in 2006, the successful businessman donated $50,000. We all got together and said we were going to rebuild. But in nine years, nothing has happened. So last year, Metley wrote two letters demanding his $50,000 be returned to me as soon as possible. And I couldn't believe they had the mitigated goal to not give me the request. Since we don't build, we're not building, I don't see any permit or nothing to build, then why should they hold my money? The church collected thousands in donations after the fire. In fact, according to 2007 and 2008 tax records, the Pritzker Foundation donated more than $400,000. A church financial report from 2013 shows more than $1.6 million in the rebuilding fund. I want a breakdown. Remember, Isaac Whitman hasn't donated nearly as much as Metley, but he too is unhappy about the stalled building plans. In December, this former IRS auditor filed papers asking the circuit courts to force the church to give the membership more detailed accounting. It doesn't say who the money was paid to, it's just a total figure. Church trustee Cynthia Jones, who refused to talk about the church finances in the past, declined an interview today. Why is this so important it's to you? It's important to determine whether or not there was waste, fraud, and abuse. Now, Whitman is back in court on Friday asking the courts to appoint a receivership and audit the church books dating back to the fire in 2006. In the meantime, Metley continues to wait for his money. Reporting live from the newsroom, Dorothy Tucker, CBS 2 News, back to you, Rob. Okay, Dorothy, thank you.